Repel on? Shouldn't I not be running into Pokemon? Or did I sort the repels and then not use one? Gosh darn it, I just mashed A so fast. <laughs> I don't want to catch a Kegus, gosh! Oh, the repel ran out? Got you. Protein gotta get swole? It's very important to get swole. If your Pokemon's not swole, is it really even ready to take on the Indigo League? Because I don't think it is. Yo, gold teeth! We in there. Um, what's this? Ah, oh, Team 32 Double Team. I don't want that. What up, buddy? Ah, finally, you're the first person to reach the secret house. Though I made a campaign for our grand opening, I was getting worried that no one would win our campaign prize. Congratulations, you have won. Yo, man, it took me forever to get here as a little kid. Like, I didn't know which way was which, and I was also, you know, just trying to catch Pokemon. So it took me a long time before I got served. Oh, I went to my menu to dig out of here. I don't have to dig! Believe me. Can I use an escape rope in here? Do I have an escape rope? Don't know if I... Oh, wait, yeah, there it is. Nope, not the time to use that. You got the super gross dentures? Hey, man. That man needs his teeth, and I need the strength. <laughs> Send photos back when she was part of Super TU. Yeah, no, as far as I'm concerned, Senpai is still a member of Super 2U. He just sh hasn't shown up to work, you know? He's like, he's like two years late, but she'll show up any day now. Oh, she also has her own stream though, which is pretty cool, you know? Two streams to be part of. I guess she took the Super 2U a little too literally. Uh, level 33, they really want you to grind? I mean, this is a safari zone, so I think, like, anything goes here. Don't want the Kangas gun. What, what am I gonna do with the Kangas gun? Uh, you need to show your strength in delivering those gross dentures in order to receive strength. Exactly, that's what I gotta do. I, uh, don't have a choice. Oh wait, that's the way out, isn't it? Nope. It must be close to the way out. Or, it's not that at all. I didn't realize that area was completely closed off. I don't normally go that way. Well, either way, time's up. We did it. Alright, see you losers later. I got a Pokemon game to beat. Her stream isn't even named the other two in you. Yo, man, that'd be a pretty weird name. Yeah, no, nah, man. She's doing pretty good with her stream, man. Which I'm really happy about. Cause like when she first started streaming, she was doing it like so like irregularly. And she was just streaming like whatever random game. But like now she, you know, she's consistent. Like I mean she still plays a lot of games, she's definitely a variety streamer overall. But yeah, no, she streams almost every single day. She streams normally at the same hours, sometimes it changes. But yeah, she normally streams at the same hours as well, which is really good. And yeah, she streams pretty consistently uh, Super Smash Bros. for Wii U and uh, Fortnite, which is super cool. I love to see all that consistency, and she's been growing really well. It's been it's been super cool, especially like because like um, with Fortnite and like Overwatch, because she plays Overwatch quite a bit too. Like with those two games, it is so hard, so incredibly hard. Oh, I don't have Fly, do I? Do I have anyone I can teach Fly to? Can Flygon learn Fly? I mean, Fly's in the name. Surely you can learn Fly. I don't have Fly. How did I not get Fly? Let's go get Fly. But, um, what was I saying? I was saying something with words and things. Oh yeah, like, uh, Fortnite. Fortnite is such a hard game to have any discoverability on. And, uh, looking at her metrics, I believe that most of the viewership that she gains while playing Fortnite doesn't come from Fortnite at all. It all comes from her Twitter. Her engagement level um, between like uh, Twitter to Twitch is so ridiculously high. It's amazing. <laughs> Never picked up Fly? Yeah, no, I forgot. Oh yeah, and I was supposed to give that guy the dentures. Eh, we'll just fly back and give it to him. No, walking away from the strings. Poor Vink's gonna have to walk back. No, I'm gonna fly back. We've been over this. 
her Twitter gets pretty crazy? It sure does. There are some things on her Twitter that, as her brother, I, you know, would appreciate not seeing. But, um, it happens. It, it does happen. <laughs> you can imagine? Yeah, it's, uh, it's not the best. It's not the best! But, uh, let's go get that fly, which is over here. Let's not pass that again. He doesn't need his teeth that badly. Just drink his meals for a while longer? Exactly, see? Glorious Goo gets it. Old guy needs to chill out. Go get his dentures. When it's time. Yes, yes. I won't tell anyone about your secret. Just give me the fly. Thank you. Alright. Fly gone. And learn fly. Absolutely, definitely. There's no way that Flygon can't learn fly. I totally expect him to be able to learn fly. Wait, where's my HMs? Are they at the top? Yeah, okay. Totally expect him. Yes, he can learn fly. I didn't. I <laughs> totally knew he could learn fly. It was so obvious. There you go, Flygon. Oh, so good, man. There's so many random Pokemon that should be able to learn fly, that can't learn fly, and then random Pokemon that can learn fly, that's like, how can they fly? This game win. <laughs> Flygon, you're so adorable. Flygon is very adorable, I would have to agree with you. Very, very cute Pokemon. Oh, I'm so looking forward to Let's Go Pikachu, Let's Go Eevee. Being able to see, I mean, we won't get the Gen 3 Pokemon, it'll just be Gen 1. But still, there's a lot of cute Pokemon, and I'm going to be able to see them in 3D, in HD. Oh, it's going to be great. So good. Oh wait, I should probably pick up that rare candy. I normally don't pick it up, because I speedrun uh, the original Pokemon Red. But, the amount of levels they want me to get in this game? <laughs> yeah. Um, no, I don't want to teach you strength. Or do I? I think I'll give it to Blastoise? Or wait, no, no, Ludicolo. He has, like, beef or something. That's pretty dumb. Let's replace that with strength. HD cuteness, exactly. And yo, XD002, Shadow Yvettel in here. How you doing? Hopefully you're doing super good today. And, uh, Control says, Dude, I never used rare candies. I forgot about them before the Elite Four mistakes were made. Yo, man. Need those rare candies. Which reminds me, I wonder if I ever picked up that rare candy that was in Cerulean Town. I normally do, but I don't know that I did. Let's go investigate real quick. I mean, I can fly around, so why not? Let's, uh, let's test that theory out, yeah? Oh, wait, is that... Oh, it's this one. How's everyone doing? I'm doing really good. You know, just playing some Pokemon, talking to chat. It's been a lot of fun. Could be better. Fair enough. And uh, Controlly says, you do need those rare candies. I had them, I planned to use them, I forgot. Oh wait, that's where the ether is. I'm not looking for ethers, I'm looking for rare candy specifically. Ludicolo, <laughs> Mirror B would be proud. Yo man, I love Ludicolo, he's my favorite Pokemon. Oh, huh, maybe there is no rare candy? Hmm, or maybe I already picked it up. Oh, nope, there it is. <laughs> Got him. Yeah, I figured it would be there, because it's there in the original red. Alright. Then, let us fly to Pallet Town! And hopefully the way isn't blocked and I can just swim to Cinnabar Island, because I, I don't want to go through the C4 miles. It's way too much effort. And the answer is... <laughs> completely blocked off. Yeah, I figured there was a good chance that was going to happen. Gosh darn you, Fire Red Generations, and your weird alterations of the map. Boo. <laughs> Boo on you, I say! Alright. To make the long trek over. I guess this is probably better. I'd probably be really underleveled if I just went straight to, uh, the gym leader. Ah, this is so much effort. If you want to reach Cinnabar Island, you're going to need to earn the Marsh Badge. If you beat Sabrina, come back to access Cinnabar Islands. Okay, fair enough. Oh yeah, I haven't even fought Sabrina yet. <laughs> Whoopsie doopsies. Give that one. 
Let's go to Celadon uh, City. Mirror B is great. He really is, man. I love, I love the dancing. I love the hairdo. It's great. The music, too good. You've beaten five gym leaders. You must be a strong trainer. Please help us fight Team Rocket. They're taking over everything. Yes. Do I have to fight them? I'm on guard duty. Gee, I'm thirsty though. Oh, wait there, the road's closed. Oh, I don't, I don't have a drink for him. Gosh darn it. Apparently I forgot to buy a drink, or I accidentally drank it already. Either way, let's go get him his dumb drink. XD and Coliseum soundtrack greater than all the other ones? Yo, man, it's so good. Though, I do really, really like the Sun and Moon OST. Uh, specifically, I'm kind of in love with the Team Skull music. And, uh, again, specifically, Guzma's theme. Guzma's theme is so good. Oh my goodness, dude. It's just, it's way too amazing. Do the dojo? Yeah, the dojo would probably be a good idea. I can get more, uh, experience there. And, uh, Gloria says, don't you need to get the tea from the old lady in this version? Do you? I don't know that to be the case. Where is this old lady? And where does she give this tea? What do I have to do to get the tea from the old lady? <laughs> is that important? Either way, I'm gonna try to give him this fresh water. She's in some house in town? In this town? In Celadon? I'll, I'll look around if I need to. Shrill says, oh sorry, just my evil rival powers activating. Nothing to see here. Yeah, no. Nah. Uh, I guess, yeah, that makes sense. They made it a key item in Fire Red, didn't they? So you couldn't, um, like, run out of money and get stuck in the game. Alright, where is this old lady? Wait, you don't give me leftovers, do you? Oh, he probably gives me the, uh, coin case. I don't want that. Not, not gambling here. That's not the plan. Oh, Team Rocket, what are you still doing here? We just shipped 2,000 more Pokemon at slot prizes again today. Don't touch the poster at the game corner. There's no secret switch behind it. Ha <laughs> They are so subtle. With the Cypher Administrator theme, though, it's God Tier. You're not wrong. It is literally God Tier. Like, when they use the word God Tier, they are describing the music in Pokemon XD. Pokemon, no, this is a hotel for people. But I just want tea. Where do I get the tea at? So you can't trap yourself yet? And gambling? What's gambling? What a silly made up word. Yo, I love how in uh, Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Let's Go Eevee for modern times, they've changed the game corner into an actual game corner. Like you sit there and they're all arcade machines. Like there's a, a black belt there and like he's clearly fight playing like Street Fighter or something. It's so cool. Vaguely remember the tea? I do not know where this tea is. Mansion? Is she in the mansion? In the city of rainbow dreams? No, I already went over there. Think it's in the mansion? Alright, one mansion coming on up. And Glorious also thinks it's in the mansion. Alright, we will find out. Not now, Torchic. Uh oh, old lady! You shouldn't spend all your money on drinks. Try this instead. <laughs> Yo! Perfect! Got the tea! Nothing be beats thirst like some hot tea. It really is the best. Yeah, you know, when I'm really thirsty, I like to drink hot beverages. Totally not just nice cold water. <laughs> Whatever. Silly game. Found it by accident? Hey, man. Oh, I can have this drink? Gee, thanks! Gulp, if you want to go to Saffron City, then go on through. Share this tea with the other guards. It's a cup of tea. I, I, how do you share that with everyone? I don't understand. To the dojo? Am I fully healed? Are you Vanks? I have a sharp beak for you. What, what am I going to do with a sharp beak? I just want to point out that Team Cypher did uh, both wrong. <laughs> both wrong? What does that mean? Everything they did, they did wrong? I guess. Oh, nothing is what you meant to say. I think that's the opposite. 
It's an endless cup of tea? Oh, that makes sense. That's a, that's a good idea. More cups of tea should be endless. Alright, this is this is it, right? Yep, find Dojo. Alright. What is this? Double battles? I'll do doubles battles. That sounds good. More experience for me. Let's do it, guys. Wah! You're trespassing in our Dragon Dojo! Oh, not a double battle. Thought it was. This town's music? Yeah. Not too bad. Oh, a bag on. Dragons? What? Like, he said dragon, and I didn't think much of it at the time, because I'm like, yeah, dragons. Chinese kung fu kind of thing. I get you. No! Nah, that's just a dragon. That's just a dragon. <laughs> Read the remark and didn't even notice? I didn't think it literally meant dragons. I didn't think it meant literal dragons, like, it said dragons. I'm like, yeah, they mean, like, you know, it's a dragon dojo. Like, a dragon fighting style dojo. They use dragon-like techniques with their fighting style. You know, stuff like that. <laughs> Not just dragons, double dragons. Yo, double dragon is one of the games on the Nintendo Switch, dude that we can play online co-op, the NES online dude. I wanna play Double Dragons. I've never beaten Double Dragons before. That would be really cool. It is and you're super excited? You should be. <laughs> this says, Controllius, I found out Vince's birthday. If you're interested. <laughs> He's clearly not. <laughs> he was listening. <laughs> Rip. All right. Let's just switch to, uh, for April 30th. <laughs> oh, man. You know, that stuff's always funny, because, like, I have a lot of friends that have, uh, birthdays around the same point in time, but people will always, like, confuse them, and they'll be like, yeah, happy birthday, Vinks! I'm like, it's not my birthday, but thank you, I appreciate it. And they're like, oh, I'm so sorry, I could have sworn it was your birthday. I'm like, no, it's so-and-so's birthday. Oh, so-and-so's birthday today? <laughs> Whoops! Gosh darn dragons. Um... Oh yeah, the last one, man. Oh wait, he was already in, right? Wasn't he? I mean, I'm like... No. Not... No, I don't... I don't resist anything he's got going on. This is a bad switch. Hidden Leaf, it's up to you. I don't think I have any good attacks to use. The FBI is calling you, you better pick up. They probably want to hire you. Yo, you're right, man. Ah, you increase the strength. Perfect. I was hoping you would do that. And <laughs> time to add my birthday to your calendar? <laughs> Why? Just a birthday. And it, it's like forever from now, so like it doesn't even matter. But literally, like what? All of the months away? At least all of the months. Like half a year. More than half a year away. Charles says, dude, so speaking of Double Dragon, in the arcade, you could actually play co-op in the game, but on the NES, the two-player was alternating one at a time. But I wonder what the two-player mode will be like. Oh, is it not, is it not actual multiplayer? I just assumed it was. Uh-oh. I could have sworn it had multiplayer, does it not? Well, one way to find out. NES, which Double Dragon multiplayer. I'm gonna look it up. There's no actual multiplayer, I'm going to be a little bit sad. Um, let's see, VentureBeat.com, what do you have to say about Double Dragon? Oh, this thing has leftovers? Ah, oh, jeesh. So you can play Double Dragon together cooperatively. Alright, this site says you can do it, but I don't know how legit that site is. Alright, what about this? Oh, this is actually Nintendo. So, is it multiple? It says two players simultaneous. It looks like there's, yeah, no, there's a guy on the left side, a guy on the right side, two health bars, it says how many credits you have. So, this is based on, oh wait, this isn't the NES one, is it? Yes, yeah, that's, that's a different one. Hmm. I didn't know that was on the Switch. 
All right, then. <laughs> what about the NES one, not the Arcade Archives? Which, again, I didn't know that was on there. But yeah, no, I don't think they did the Arcade one and the NES one also be in the Arcade. That wouldn't <clears throat> make any sense. Oh my goodness, why do I have to be paralyzed? Hmm. Oh, if only there was, like, a website that would tell me. I can't find anything, then. Alright, let's see. What were we saying in chat? Uh, the NES version was not actual multiplayer. I could have sworn it had multiplayer. Arcade was painful. Get to the end and fight each other. Ah, uh, yeah. Are you sure that's only on the arcade? Because I've played against a friend in Double Dragon. Maybe it wasn't Double Dragon 1? I don't know. I don't remember. That was, that was like back in like the 1990s, so I don't know. Uh, that being said, there was a true two-player mode, but it was one-on-one -on -one fighting. Okay, yeah, that's, that's what I remember then. We can try it, Banks. We do have it. All you have to do is, you know, let me be your Switch friend. Maybe the arcade one. <laughs> I need to know this. My switch is right here. I can multitask. Oh, generosity still alive? Yeah, put the last one in. Alright, switch, if you would just turn on, that would be great. Alright, yes, Nintendo. Oh, it's a little loud. You should turn down. I'm trying to play Pokemon. I don't need you being all loud. Um. Yeah, switch Pokemon. Generosity will sack you. Sorry, hun. Alright, so no, I don't want to play offline. I'll put this over here. I guess I can accept these friend requests while I'm at it. Okay, let's see. Friend list. Or add friend. Yes, friend request. And yep, there is one from Catrolius. I will accept that. You can be my friend. You can become friends. Became friends, perfect. I like that uh, that was such a smooth process. All right. And yeah, if anyone wants to be my friend, if you have Nintendo Switch and you want to play games with me or whatever, feel free to add me. Um, I think what is, I think it's like exclamation mark FC. I think that's my command. Yeah, there it is. That's my friend code right there. In case you do want to add me. I forgot I had choice band on and I accidentally used flame kick. It's not very effective. Also the only move I can use right now. So, I'm currently on... Oh, you have to press Z, L, and ZR to back out. And let's see. Multitasking, okay. Yeah, play online. Um, oh, I need a friend. Unable to find friends' games. Oh, you have to start the game? Do I start the game? Is that how it works? Start your own game while you wait for a friend. Yeah, I, I want to do that. How do I start the game? Is that a passcode? No passcode. It's a lot of effort. Oh, I should have switched Pokemon. I didn't realize... Oh, whoops. I... No, I'm still trying to use the PlayStation. You can begin playing while you wait. You'll be notified when a friend joins. Okay. We're waiting to see if you can see me on the game. Alright. The Double Dragon. Double Dragon. Where is that? Double Dragon. It was here a second ago. Oh, there it is. Double Dragon. Alright, press the start button. Start button. Why is this not working? Oh yeah. Mode a two-player? That looks a lot like a two-player game to me. I only see, yeah, I do only see the one player's health. I chose two player though, didn't I? Oh, it is take turns. Yeah, it must be take turns then. Yeah, rip. That's such a shame. You can't, it's not simultaneous. And yo, am I beating this dragon air right now with like my blaze kicks? <laughs> oh, yo, Super Sin Slayer has come to play. 
The banks will control the menu. Connection strength will vary. Okay, interesting. Alright. So if I die, then Super Sin Slayer takes over, right? Yeah, let me see that. <laughs> oh yeah, and you can move this little hand cursor around. That's hilarious. But yeah, I did make it so anyone could join. Oh, wait, why did it stop moving? Yeah, fight me, guys. I know I'm not moving around myself, but just beat me up. I'm trying to see that this works. <laughs> this is so funny, man. So funny. And... Ah, I died. Alright, so yeah, mission one. Come on. And yep, there's second player, and I'm not controlling it. That's Super Sin Slayer, so yeah. That is, that is unfortunately the multiplayer for Double Dragon on NES, but on the bright side, River City Ransom's in here, so we can still do River City Ransom, you know, which has real beat-em-up uh, multiplayer side-scrolling action. Um, I do plan on uh, getting, thanks to Controlius, um, the Capcom uh, beat-em-up bundle, so I can play that. Yep, you've been disconnected from Super Sin Slayer. Goodbye! And, um, so yeah, I'm gonna play that. Yeah, River City Ransom. And then, yeah, there's the Arcade Archives version of the arcade game for Double Dragon. So the multiplayer is out there. You just have to get the arcade version, which I didn't even know was on the Switch. I had no idea. River City Ransom so good. I know, right? And uh, sad that so many games were like that and they sold it as online <laughs> multiplayer online. I know, right? Oh, jeez. It's so like, what are, you, what are you doing, guys? What are you doing? But, you know, it is what it is. Are there any other games they could add to like the NES that would be legit? And yo, <laughs> Legend with the host. Yo, thanks for the host, Legend. I appreciate it. Flygon is asleep. The NES multiplayer games. I'm gonna look up on the internet, see what I can find. I'm curious what they could add. I mean, Mario Brothers is already on there, and River City Ransom is probably the best game. Oh, yo, Bubble Bobble! Yo, Bubble Bobble. I love Bubble Bobble. Tell me I'm not the only person that knows what this game is. And oh, your retro arc works? Yo, congrats, Legend. Ice Climbers? I've never played Ice Climbers. Is it any good? Beat em ups are good fun with friends. They really are. I really like uh, beat em ups. And yo, Tim Thocker just subscribed with the tier 2 sub. Subscribed 15 months in a row. What's Bubble Bobble? Yo, Catrolia says Bubble Bobble is awesome. Sturm Crow remembers Bubble Bobble. Alright, alright, you know, I'm not the only person in here that's played Bubble Bobble, man. Ah, jeez. Cool. Man, there's some dark memories mixed in from the last time I played Bubble Bobble. I was a small child, man. I was like, how old was I? I think I was... Ah, jeez. I think Gypsy was... Gypsy was two, right? Gypsy was two or three, so I was like four or five years old, right? So I'm playing Bubble Bobble, and I'm getting so far into the game, man. And like, I'm at, a, I'm at my uh, grandmother's house. And I'm like, oh man, this is so awesome. Normally, you know, when I go over to someone's place and like try to play games over there, I don't get to finish the game, but I'm like so close. And then we had to leave, like just randomly out of nowhere and the parents were all really upset and I was like, well, pff, this is lame, you know? And I never got to finish Bubble Bubble. Turns out, I didn't know. So essentially my grandmother was making, she was cooking something with like potatoes or whatever and she was cutting up some potatoes. And uh, my mom and dad were like somewhere else because my grandmother was watching us. I don't know what she was off doing, but Gypsy went into the kitchen, saw the knife in the potato, and decided, again reminding you, she was two or three years old, that she would cut the potato. And instead, she uh, almost cut her finger off, so we had to take her to the hospital. But uh, yeah, no, she was, she was just fine. As you can see, she was just here a second ago with all ten fingers. But oh man. Never played Bubble Bobble since. <sighs> <laughs> Alright, who am I sending in next? Let's do Super Trash, that'll work. Um, you brought over Tenth Doctor? <laughs> Hope you don't mind? No, that's cool, man. He's, he's good people, it checks out. Um, 
what's the best attack here? Break break, metal claw, bite. Oh, bite, because I'm a dark type. And uh, Super Sin Slayer says, I know Bubble Wobble, I have yet to play it in multiplayer though. We gotta play Nest multiplayer things. Absolutely, man. And Storm Crow says, maybe they add Battle Toads? Yo, Battle Toads! Because yeah, that's that's actually two person multiplayer, right? Right? Yo, I would play some Battle Toads, legit. That would be awesome. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles? Oh my goodness. Let's go, dude. Let's see, what else? What else? Um. I don't think Super C was simultaneous multiplayer. Um, neither was Marble Madness, but I wouldn't mind Marble Madness. That's a fun game. Oh, dude! Rampage? Rampage was on the NES? I didn't know it was on the NES. I played it in arcades. Does it have real multiplayer? Is the NES version any good? And yo, Bomberman? Yo. Yo, yo, yo. I love me some Bomberman. I have Super Bomberman R. I bought that day one, even though it <laughs> went on sale for, or it went from like $60 to $40 shortly thereafter, and I was very salty about it. But I still bought it for full price, which I don't think it, you know, I didn't know what the content was. I was just very excited for the game. I wasn't not going to buy it. But yeah, no, nah, man. I love Bomberman so much. Yo, Turtles in Time? Yo, Turtles in Time is great. Oh, they have to do a SNES one as well, right? Like, oh man, imagine if they gave a Super Nintendo game. It would be done. And let's see, I was missing things. Um, doo -ba -doo -ba -doo. Now there was something you wanted to add to the list in Doctor? <laughs> you don't remember? And uh, Controller says, Arcade Archives, $8 a piece. Not worth it, Double Dragon on Steam. First three, cheaper. Oh, Double Dragons on Steam? And dude, if they add Battletoads, I want to play it with you, thanks. <laughs> yeah, it sounds good, but we still got to play the Capcom games. We got a lot of games to play through. And Grandma says, well, just when I was about to say goodnight to Legend, he hosted Vinks. I guess now I don't have to type it twice. Yo, yeah, get your sleep, man. Two-player Battletoads would be fun, but man, it'd be impossible. Yes, I'm down for anything, man. Like, there is no video game I have played on my stream that I am... Uh, like, I'm just gonna quit on. Absolutely not. Like, there's only two games, I think, I think, I've ever, like, put off to the side to play later, and that's Mike Tyson's Punch-Out, which I actually am going to be borrowing a NES Mini to play that. I haven't decided when, but I'll be doing that sometime in the nearest future. Nearish. And then, um, also... What was the other one? Oh, yeah, and the other one was, uh... What's that game called? Something with like puzzles and walking around and the puzzles don't explain themselves. Y'all know what it is. A weak version of Rampage? Oh, is it no good? And Contra was simultaneous multiplayer for NES? Because I know the Super Nintendo did, but did NES have simultaneous multiplayer on NES? Oh, yes, I need that. I need Contra. Absolutely, please. That would be so good. Who's my favorite, uh, Battletoad? Yo, I don't know the names of the Battletoads, like... I can't remember. I used to watch that cartoon when I was a kid. I'm sure I had a favorite back then, but... I got no idea, man. Um... I guess I'll just choose whichever one's in Killer Instinct? Cause he looks really cool, man. I don't have Killer Instinct, it's a pretty, pretty cool game. But yeah, no, man, um, I used to, like, watch gameplay videos of it all the time, and then when he came out, I was like, oh my goodness. But yeah, I'm pretty hardcore into Street Fighter V now, so I don't think that's a game I'll get into. But yeah, no, like, still, it looks it looks pretty legit to me, in my opinion. Um, I'm gonna go for Dragonite. The original Contra was simultaneous? I didn't know that. Oh, The Witness! There it is. Yup, yup. And they one-hit Legends. Gosh darn it, Legends. Um, yeah, let's use Super Trash. And the Double Dragon Trilogy is $6 on Steam. First three arcade ports. Yo, that's awesome! And it's, it's the arcade versions. Let's go. I mean, that makes sense. They would probably have to, you know, they couldn't do the NES ones. And uh, let's see, you want the SNES Battletoads? Ah, uh, yeah, there was uh, the SNES Battletoads. Um, I'm not sure if there's multiple of them, but yeah, there's definitely one, right, where it's Battletoads and Double Dragon in the same game, because I have that on Super Nintendo, like, I have the cartridge. 
somewhere. I, I don't know where I put it, but it exists! Rashes and Killer Instinct? Well, then that's my favorite. <laughs> Rash. I'll go with him. This boy still ain't finished Sonic 06. I did beat Sonic 06. I got to the credits. If you get to the credits, that means you beat the game. Remember? I was there. Were you there? Did you watch me get to the credits? Because I got there. What is that? Legends. Fuzzy clap? Those are... Those are, uh... Kitty claps, I guess. Uh, Gloria says, I enjoyed The Witness. Was a bit pretentious, though, which kind of ruined the experience a bit. That's fair. Like, um... I don't know how far into the game I got. I think there was, like, these, like, major puzzles we had to get that connected laser to the center of the map. I think I did two of those. I think I did two. I might have done one and found the way to the second one, but didn't start it yet. I don't remember. So I was, I wasn't super far into the game, but I figured out a lot of the puzzles. Oh, whoops, why did I choose Blaze Kick? Gosh darn it, I wasn't paying attention. It was a critical hit! I should've, I should've opened up with Legend, that would've been much better. Or actually, I should let someone faint and then swap into Legend so he has a chance, but I don't know, I don't think he's fast enough. I don't think he'll outspeed either of those Pokémon. Oh, it's a new emote from Fuzzy? Fair enough. I do not know Fuzzy, but that is a nice emote. I like the kitty paws. I am pro cats. Not that I have a cat. I wouldn't want to actually have one. I just think they're cute. Uh, Katrona says there's Battletoads, Double Dragon, which was very good, and also, uh, Battletoads and Battle Maniacs, which was a high graphics Battletoads. It was very good. Oh, okay, nice! Torna? Torna. Is Torna that Xenoblade thing? That was DLC, wasn't it? Is that free DLC or is that something you have to pay for? I assume you have to pay for it. Because if I remember right, it looked pretty substantial. You like The Witness? The puzzles were well made? Yeah, I. the puzzles are really, really good. Yeah, no, man. Um, I'm pretty sure I have a video of, of like me solving one of the puzzles because of just how much of a genius I am. It's pretty good. Yeah, did I? I uploaded that somewhere. Did I ever put that on Twitter? I don't know. <laughs> it would take too long to find it. This fight's done. We'll we'll have to fight them again a different time. Maybe when I'm higher level. It's paid DLC. Oh, okay, okay. How much is the DLC for Torna? It's basically its own game. Is it? Is it that substantial? How? Um, cause I I knew it was big, but. Like, how, how many hours are we talking here? There's no serious uses for a clapping emote. <laughs> and Legend says, unfortunately, it doesn't combo with Fuzzy's only other kitty emote. Yo, rip. And Controller says, is it the one that took you 45 minutes to solve inks? That's the entirety of chat and figured out two solutions for it. Yeah, that's the video, but I'm sure it didn't take me 45 minutes. You're probably exaggerating a bit there. Probably exaggerating. You know, let's see. Should probably put that up on YouTube. Because I have the video still on my uh, desktop. I'll just upload that real quick. That way I don't lose it. Uh, Tin Doctor, $20 for the whole expansion pass. I'm told it's 12 hours, but I'm not done with it yet to say for sure. Yo, that sounds pretty good to me. That's, uh, that's a pretty good deal. But yo, uh, give me one second, guys. I'll be right back. 